You see, weeks ago, Doug could barely walk due to severe pain in his lower back. I really started to get to that point where it was like, if this is life, it's not living. As these images provided by Ohio's Christ Hospital show. He had what's called lumbar isthmic spondylolisthesis, where one bone slides forward on the other because of a defect in the posterior arch. Doug's daughter, Jordan, a gymnast for eight years, has the same problem, which is common in athletes. Patients who have this type of condition typically are wrestlers, football players, gymnasts, uh, type of sports that require rapid extension movement. Spine surgeon Dr. Jared Crasto told me about one in every four patients he sees has this condition. To relieve Doug's pain? He had a lumbar inner body fusion through a direct lateral approach. While fusions have been around for years, it's this new breakthrough lateral approach that is changing patients' lives. Rather than the way it used to be done through an open incision in the abdomen, which raises the risk for severe complications, this newer approach is minimally invasive. It fuses the spine using an approach from the side of the lower back. I have three incisions, oh, yeah. um, two here, and then there's one here on the side. As you can see on these before and after images, the area of the spine causing Doug's pain is now stabilized with a cage that allows the spine to come together and heal. Doug came home from the hospital in 48 hours after this procedure to a very grateful Bailey. Doug is grateful to be pain free. The back pain has been gone since pretty much the, the same day. I mean, when they got me up and started walking me in the hospital, I did not have back pain. As for Doug's daughter, Jordan, she did leave gymnastics due to the back pain caused by this same problem. She's managing it now, but may need the same procedure if the pain gets worse. You can always find our stories here on YouTube, but go ahead and click subscribe to get notifications and stay in the know.